Devarim chapter 12 These are the laws and right rulings which you guard to do in the land which Yahweh your Elohim of your fathers is giving you to possess all the days that you live on the soil. Completely destroy all the places where the nations which you are dispossessing serve their mighty ones on the high mountains and on the hills and under every green tree and you shall break down their slaughter places and smash their pillars and burn their asharim with fire and you shall cut down the carved images of their mighty ones and shall destroy their name out of that place. Do not do so to Yahweh your Elohim but seek the place which Yahweh your Elohim chooses out of all your tribes to put his name there for his dwelling place and there you shall enter and there you shall take your ascending offerings and your slaughters and your tithes and the contributions of your hand and your vowed offerings and your voluntary offerings and the firstlings of your herd and of your flock and there you shall eat before Yahweh your Elohim and shall rejoice in all that you put your hand to you and your households in which Yahweh your Elohim has blessed you do not do as we are doing here today each one doing whatever is right in his own eyes because you have not yet entered the rest and the inheritance which Yahweh your Elohim is giving you. But you shall pass over the Yarden, and shall dwell in the land which Yahweh your Elohim is giving you to inherit, and he shall give you rest from all your enemies round about, and you shall dwell in safety. And it shall be that unto the place which Yahweh your Elohim chooses to make his name dwell there, there you are to bring all that I command you, your ascending offerings and your slaughters and your tithes and the contributions of your hand, and all your choice offerings which you vow to Yahweh. And you shall rejoice before Yahweh your Elohim, you and your sons and your daughters, and your male servants and your female servants, and the Levite who is within your gates, since he has no portion nor inheritance with you. Guard yourself that you do not offer your ascending offerings in every place that you see, except in the place which Yahweh chooses, in one of your tribes. There you are to offer your ascending offerings, and there you are to do all that I command you. Only, whatever your being desires, you shall slaughter and eat, according to the blessing of Yahweh your Elohim, which he has given you. Within all your gates, the unclean and the clean do eat of it, of the gazelle and the deer alike. Only the blood you do not eat, pour it on the earth like water. You are not allowed to eat within your gates the tithe of your grain, or of your new wine, or of your oil, or of the firstlings of your herd or your flock, or of any of your offerings which you vow, or of your voluntary offerings, or of the contribution of your hand. But eat them before Yahweh your Elohim, in the place which Yahweh your Elohim chooses, you and your son and your daughter, and your male servant and your female servant, and the Levite who is within your gates. And you shall rejoice before Yahweh your Elohim in all that you put your hands to. Guard yourself that you do not forsake the Levite as long as you live in your land. When Yahweh your Elohim enlarges your border as he has promised you, and you say, Let me eat meat, because you long to eat meat, you eat as much meat as your being desires. When the place where Yahweh your Elohim chooses to put his name is too far from you, then you shall slaughter from your herd and from your flock which Yahweh has given you, as I have commanded you, and you shall eat within your gates as much as your being desires. Only, as the gazelle and the deer are eaten, so you are to eat of it, the unclean and the clean alike eat of it. Only, be strong not to eat the blood, for the blood is the life. Do not eat the life with the meat. Do not eat it, you pour it on the earth like water. Do not eat it, that it might be well with you and your children after you, when you do what is right in the eyes of Yahweh. Only the set-apart gifts which you have and your vowed offerings, you are to take up and go to the place which Yahweh chooses, and you shall make your ascending offerings, the meat and the blood, on the slaughter place of Yahweh your Elohim, and the blood of your slaughterings is poured out on the slaughter place of Yahweh your Elohim, and you eat the meat. Guard and obey all these words which I command you, that it might be well with you and your children after you forever, when you do what is good and right in the eyes of Yahweh your Elohim. When Yahweh your Elohim does cut off from before you the nations which you go to dispossess, and you dispossess them and dwell in their land, guard yourself that you are not ensnared to follow them after they are destroyed from before you, and that you do not inquire about their mighty ones, saying, How did these nations serve their mighty ones? and let me do so too. Do not do so to Yahweh your Elohim, for every abomination which Yahweh hates they have done to their mighty ones, for they even burn their sons and daughters in the fire to their mighty ones. All the words I am commanding you, guard to do it. Do not add to it, nor take away from it.